So Borderlands 4 runs like shit, and I'm going to teach you how to make it not run like shit. First thing you should do on Steam is go right-click on Borderlands 4, go to Properties, and then go to General, and put Dash No Startup Movies. Every time you load the game, you'll just skip that annoying Gearbox intro, and it helps out a lot there. You could also put the command No Volumetric Fog to see if that works. I don't see an option within the game to turn it off completely, so if you guys want to take a chance on that for better FPS, Volumetric Fog was a big decrease in Borderlands 3. You could try it again in Borderlands for. I also did try going into the game user settings and changing volumetric fog to disabled and I didn't notice any FPS increase from disabled to low so maybe you cannot fully disable it in this game. Going into your options go into your basic and make sure your vertical sync is off you will get more FPS. Field of view both of them all the way up of course. Advanced keep your graphics preset on whatever you want. In a quick TLDR before I get into this I am on a 4080 super and a Ryzen 9 processor so mileage may vary but this should work for everybody. Upscaling I use TS are just because it's less performance intensive and i hate how dlss looks and how blurry it is and i use the quality preset no upscaling quality but we do have scene capture quality at full resolution frame gen is off if you want more frames turn it on don't like how it looks i don't like my ai frames make sure your low latency is on boost just so you have less input lag loading range keep it on far as it is open world and it makes it a whole lot easier on yourself geometry detail keep on medium texture quality i would put this on low to medium if your computer's on the lower end of the recommended specs i just put it on high because I care about the textures a little bit more. Texture streaming speed, regardless of your platform, you should be putting this as high as possible. It's how quick the texture limits will load in quicker, so it's less pop-up when you're playing the game. Filtering quality, put this as low as possible for more FPS or turn it off completely. I just have it hovering around a four for my personal opinion. Foliage density, turn this off if you really need the FPS because you really don't need to see all the little grass waving in the wind. It's really not that big of a deal. I put it on very low just so I could see some of it and be a little bit immersed volumetric fog low again if you could turn this off i would same with volumetric clouds off or low i wish you could turn it off shadow quality keep on medium i wouldn't recommend low because low medium have similar performance and the game on low shadows just looks like shit directional shadow quality this is another thing that's going to mess on your fps i would turn this low for most people i just have it on medium because once again i want the game to look a little bit good disable volumetric cloud shadows that will cascade shadows from the clouds onto the floor and it has a huge performance impact lighting quality i keep on medium not many fps differences from low to medium but from medium to high it was pretty significant reflections low to medium same deal same similar fps but going above medium does drop your fps quite a bit shading quality i only noticed a difference on low medium once again post processing keep as high as possible just for your post processing effects it doesn't really change much motion blur mount turn it off motion blur looks like shit and that's really it i have the copy paste for the launch options in the comments down below and uh, let's hope this game runs good and if you don't have enough fps from doing this and you have a card that supports it turn on the AI frames and yeah, hit the like button, subscribe. Love you guys. Enjoy Borderlands 4.